Hello and welcome to my homework and today I want to um, explain what can we do with for loops within arrays. Well, for loops can be um, present our content in the arrays. Uh, if you don't know uh, yet, then arrays will be um, if you if you want uh, if you want initialize them then each placeholder in the array will present zero okay so um, if we have like five placeholders and we didn't initialize them then basically it will look like that one two three four five Okay, each placeholder, like placeholder, placeholder number one will present zero, place number two will present zero, place number three uh, will present zero, and so on. So we can actually print them with the for loops, okay, or initialize them within the for loops, and we will we will see uh, here it now. Um, so let's go and make some uh, array int brackets we will call it r okay for array uh, new int 7 we want 7 placeholders and then we will say um, for loop and we'll call it i and then we will say r, which is our uh, array, okay? And then we will say length, okay? And with this one, and you can see in the IntelliSense that length present the number of placeholders that I have in r, so r dot length means the length which is 7 in R so we'll basically be, what basically we'll be doing is that I which is 0 we will loop for we will loop until it reach 7 which is uh, the number of placeholders in R okay so let's do r i equals i times 2 okay so what were, what are we doing r which is our array um r i which is um, which will be um, the loop okay the, the it will be uh, increased by one each time and then we will we will will get is uh, each loop we will get different numbers so r1 r0 r2 r6 uh, I don't know okay which each placeholder and then we will get i which is whatever um, number it is it can be 2 it can be it can be 4 and then we will get times 2 so uh, let's let's demonstrate it what what will what we're going to do it will be basically um, place in the same placeholder i times 2 which is 2, 4, 6, and so on. Okay, and then we want to make another for loop. Okay, r dot length. And then we want to print it. Print it.
print it out okay we'll print whatever whatever um, the I is whatever the RI is okay let's see and maybe we'll get this one so it will be nicely um, okay so zero two four six eight ten twelve 